All right. Hey, everybody, it's F-Bomb Fitzgerald playing a little heavy on pier with my friend Catfish. So it sounds like she wants to go pocket medic, just chill out. So I'm going to go heavy because that's always a good power class to run on payload attack. Uh, it looks like they've got a lot of heavy medic combos. At least I got one medic. But with the timing of their counter uber, they're going to get me. Yeah, I'm dead. Alright, so it sounds like they got a level 3 up this way. Can I catch this medic out? Oh yeah, he should have run away. Yeah, it looks like they have a rescue ranger. Or their NG at least knows to do that. Oh, that's the guy who killed me before. Hey! Alright, glad I got some revenge there. But even with a medic, I got to grab that little pack. Because I am our front line here. Hopefully they're clearing the card of any spies. I just want to keep putting bullets in front of us so we can cap this point. Yeah, let's let's peek this corner. I haven't heard an NG. Oh no, I did hear a sentry. But this is a well-timed crits from our random pub medic. Ooh, that was pretty good. Yeah, that pyro should have laid off. Oh, and... Gotta remember that their spy is running big earner. But yeah, if I got a 10 streak, let's check my eyes, because who knows how long I'm going to keep these fire horns. And it looks like the rest of the team is pushing up pretty good, so I'm just going to hang back on the cart and make sure we keep pushing it. Uh-oh, don't like this flanking pyro. Also don't like being on fire. All right, there's Catfish. I just want to make sure that this pyro isn't lingering in the back line anywhere. Yeah, we might be okay. I'm also a little paranoid because I haven't seen their spy since I killed him around this truck earlier. Oh, that's satisfying. I love killing taunting flog pyros just as they're popping oomph. Looks like our soldier's covering that flank, so I don't have to watch my back as much. Yeah, our team's pushing forward pretty aggressively. Uh, I might as well pop this platform, I guess, because I can't push the cart until it moves. Yeah, let's go around back this way in case they're retreating already. Oh, I think that's the same medic from before. He might be trying to battle medic with the Blute Sauger. And if that's the case, I always have the advantage on him as heavy. Alright, make sure there's no tellies. That was a weird little bucket. Don't remember that being there before. And yeah, this has uh, been an interesting round so far. I feel like, on one hand, I want to keep pushing the front lines like this, even if I'm just harassing. On the other hand, I want to push the cart. Oh, there's a flanking scout here. I gotta protect our medics. And, yeah, let's just not peek that sight line while I'm under 150. Yeah, I kind of just want to protect the cart. But if they're going to pop Ubers on me, I feel obliged to, to move up a little bit to at least intimidate Red to back off some. I wish this pub medic would wait a second longer before hitting Kritz's. I hate having to vote. Well, I'm taking fire. Uh, of course, it's always on 19. All right, well, I almost got the godlike there, but more importantly, I think we've got him in a good position that we can really push this and get the win. Can I shoot through this? Oh, I guess I can. Yeah, they don't have enough up to defend this. I think we got it in the bag. Well, hey, that was a fun round of heavy. Let me know in the comment section what you thought of it. Thanks for watching as always, and I'll see you in the next video.